Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Let's Play Elex. So in the last episode of Jax, uh, he was doing uh, a bunch of missions, including Kaya's, and he finished uh, Arx's mission. We ate, <laughs> we ate uh, the Cyclops heart meat dish, whatever. Um, and uh, I realized something. Um, first of all, let me just make sure that. Um, oh. Oh my gosh, apparently the Woodlight meat has radiation resistance, which I think I should make. <laughs> okay, uh, but apart from that... Um... Hold on a second. <laughs> I'm just making a stuff, pretty much. Oh my lord, this is quite Are a... Are you here to pay me those shards you owe me? Because I'm pissed at well, how you long you admit he has a point. Pay. <laughs> so some people over here are pissed Stop at each other, haha. Ha. But anyway, um, so apparently there's a quest. I have a quest to check out my living uh, quarters here in Origin. I don't know why I do, but I do. Oh wait, this is a nice place. Oh, you just realized that, Kaya, after living here for days and weeks. But anyway, my living quarters are somewhere nearby. They are over here. And this is my current living quarters, apparently. Huh. At the moment, it's very run down and... Yeah. Hmm, pack of cigarettes. And I have a locked safe, apparently. No, well, I'm not good enough for that. Oh, I'm really bad at hacking, apparently. Oh my, can I actually learn hacking? Or rather, the next level of hacking. I think I should be intelligent enough. I mean... Hack? Yes, I should be able to. Uh, now I gotta find a craft, uh, a craft strainer because I don't remember. I don't remember. And then we can come back here, I guess, to lockpick that. Ooh. A metal scrap and a chest. Oh, there's a gemstone and elixir. Sure, why not? Let's take everything. There's mana. Oh, there's a puzzle with the map pieces that I have. Another locked safe. Oh, maybe it's uh, related to the map? I'm clicking on it, but nothing happens. Yeah. Okay. I have a double bed. A healing potion, a recipe for making a powerful healing potion. That's nice. Uh, unless it's useless one. <laughs> okay, yeah. Let's get our crafts trainer. Pretty much. If I remember correctly... Oh, no. He was a survival trainer. Oh. Alric! Yeah, sure. Let's go find Alric. Long time no see, I guess. <laughs> Let me find the general direction of where you are. You're somewhere this way. That technology will get you into trouble here. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> but, uh, whatever helps you uh, sleep peacefully, I guess. Okay. Now, uh, ooh, that was weird. <laughs> okay, I think I'm going the right way. Man, Eden is really cool. Or rather, Goliath is a pretty cool city. With so many hills that you can just scale up and down and stuff. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I, I really like this location. A lot more than Tavar or Ignadon. Ignadon is a little too bleak. Too much of a tech. Now, he should be somewhere here. Yes! Okay. So let's learn that. Okay, the next level I need cutting, which I don't really have, but if I find an item that can up my hacking skill, that'll be nice. Each level gives an additional attempt when hacking. Eh. Gives more time to complete hacking with every level. Unlocks the ability to equip certain weapons. Haha, uh -huh. okay. Ooh, rings and amulets, but I think you need recipes for those. And stuff. 
Sh I can learn pickpocketing. You know what? Sure. If I need to, I can do that. <laughs> I want to see what it is about anyway. Okay. So now let's that go back to will get you into origin. Right over there. And let's go uh, crack open that uh, safe, I guess. Where is it? Oops. <laughs> ah, you're losing your general direction, Jax. <laughs> okay, there you go. Now it's very hackable. Oh, oh my god. Um. Okay, nine was the third one. <laughs> I'm totally doing it this way. Okay, nine and the three, and then eight was somewhere around. Um, okay, let's try this again. Uh, okay, let's try eight. I don't know. Six, nine, one. Oh! Two, three, zero? That didn't work. That did not work. Oh man, I forgot the numbers. Oh. Um. Yeah, no, one sec. <laughs> I already forgot. Eight. Ugh. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's try this again. Uh. Eight, six, nine, four. Seven, maybe. I'm in. Yeah. Okay, there you go. And yeah, there's, uh, there's everything. <laughs> Okay, so now that we're done over here, I actually tagged a quest for killing the Chimeras, because I believe with a flamethrower I should be able uh, to take them on. That must be hundreds of years old. You think we'd have learned by now? Um, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about, Kaya, but whatever it is, I hope it's useful. Okay, so. Let's go get a perfect spot on those chimeras, eh? I'm gonna take the direct route towards the chimeras. Hopefully, uh, I'll be able to take them on, and maybe I'll I'll be able even to do that um, mech quest from Martha. Because I have a flamethrower now. I'll just need to make sure I'll have enough money to actually get the fuel if I run out. Oh, that might be actually uh, problematic. Oh well, we'll see how it goes. First of all, Chimeras and getting a high point so that I'll stay alive. <laughs> oh, I think I'm actually at the high point. Yeah, okay, one of them is right below us. Oh, look, look over here. Man, a small potion, cigarettes, yummy. <laughs> Except the cigarettes, of course. And the Chimeras, I see one over there. Okay, let's save because I don't want this thing to go really badly. There you go, one Count of them. On uh oh. Um. Very confused. And also, why is that critter over there? Also, I need to go find that chimera. I see where it ran off to. Sort of. First of all, I wanna kill the bird, it's bothering me. Also, how did you climb up here? <coughs> Managed to block that one, eh? Oh, it's right below me. Brilliant. It basically is a nightshade, but a little different. Be careful. Oh. Well, they're not able to throw in fancy stuff. So that's good to know. Yeah, I should be able to uh, kill them without a hitch. Yeah, 
they're just they're just like, oh, what do I do? Okay, one of them is dead. Akai is not doing anything. She's just stuck, I think. The other one is dead. And I leveled up, thank god. <laughs> I was talking about at the end of last episode about getting more dexterity. No. Okay, that last one is giving me a headache. I think. I need to... Oh, there we go. Kai is here, but... Yeah, finally you decided to help. There we go. She's gonna finish it. <laughs> Kai is freaking out as always. There we go. That was easy. I guess maybe with the robots it's gonna be the same. But yeah, mm. that's the only thing I can think of about how to do this quest. <laughs> oh my gosh, I just pushed it off. Let me see, there might be loot. Oh, a warrior's poison sword. What the heck is that? <laughs> Let me check. Oh my god, it's so much better than the freaking energy hammer. And I just need 64 strength. Oh, but I'm like the hammer, it's at level two. You know what? It's actually- it's still better than the hammer, I think. And... is it? It's a berserker sword, apparently. Not even a cleric weapon. Oh, that kind of sucks. I want to be, uh, immersive. <laughs> I want to do my faction weapons. You know? Okay, so I see a, a whole lot of blood. Oh, wait! There's a, an elix deposit over there. We should definitely go and pick up something. If possible. Also, yeah, that. <laughs> I need iron, I need everything, I need sulfur. Actually, yeah, I need sulfur the most. Might have to end up buying it though. Or I might have to uh, running, uh, run around and gather it. And hopefully stay alive. <laughs> okay, let's see. There's a deposit over here of Elix. Could have been better. Not bad. Anything natural over here? No. Eh, sucks. Kinda, I kind of want more of the natural elix because I kind of need it for everything. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything over here. Some fancy mushrooms. Oh, yeah. Apparently there is. There's an oil lamp that I found. A piece of ore. A mighty healing potion. That's not bad. That's good. That's good. And I think that's it. Oh, there's a pile of human bones. But yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, I should probably go to the guy who ordered me to kill the chimeras. Um, I forgot who that was, actually. Uh, some recruit. I know who you're talking about. Oh, I think that's him over there. They, yeah, that's him. The Chimeras are dead. All of them? Are you sure? All of them, for sure. Wow. Maybe Kalan did send you. Perhaps I should believe more. Yeah, and that's about it. <laughs> I guess that's uh, the completion of the quest. Okay, so yeah, why not? We can do the so mech, annoying. maybe. So, or, so annoying. or we can do Abessa, finally. <laughs> Actually, yeah, let's go to He's Abessa. Us, you know. Let's go to the Don't City. I mean, I did pick up a fancy claw, and I know where to I use it, and Suppose I never did show you where you can use it, so... Let's go to Obessa. Kai is gonna be very happy to return back to the city of opportunities. And love, peace, and quiet. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, uh, I'm just trolling at this point. <laughs> but yes, um, to find the application for the claw, we gotta go all around, all the way around the city, and we gotta go uh, this way. And then I'll try to see uh, if I if I can find more NPCs to uh, to talk to. 
Oh wait, that's an exit. <laughs> yeah, so we go this way. Outlaws. Yes, I heard things were rough though. Mm, not quite there yet. Okay, I'm reaching the place. Okay, somewhere around here in the back. This looks like something, right? But no, I think it's... Ah, there it is. That's uh, that's what we need. I think. I'll need the key. Oh. I'll need the key. You'll need uh, the key. I forgot how to use the... Uh... Hmm. Weird, okay, then I don't remember exactly how you, you, you use it. I thought that's where you use the claw. I'll need the key. Hmm. Then someone is supposed to give me a key, I think. Oh, no, I remember. I remember now. Okay, no, I'm doing this way too early. Okay, sorry about that. I need to go to a certain house, and I believe it actually might be... that one over there. Eh. Also, I might as well talk to a bunch of people while I'm at it. Except I'm not finding anyone yet. <laughs> hmm. Anything to loot? No? Ah, that sucks. Ah! I think there it is. Okay. Okay, attention thieves, we read that before. Ooh, a mug, and no one will I'm mind it. it. I don't want anything to do with it. Why is it so damn dark in here? <laughs> really believe it? As he wishes. Man, the light is not you adjusting for some damn reason. Oh well, that's not just again. my game being my game. You can forget it, Brabeck. I serve everyone. Here. I don't want anything to do. Save yourself some work and some pain by doing what I say. There's no one here not Felix out there for that. From the gutters, and so you I keep your work. supplies for the real people. What do you care who I serve? I still serve you, do even you though the other that? people complain really about it. it. So you are taking their side, are you? As he wishes. I'm on nobody's You should side. do it. I'm just getting on with my job. You had He's better been bothering reconsider me with that this. For days now. Reconsider what? One wrong word and the clerics will throw you out of I the city. I don't want anything to do with it. So do us both a favor and calm the hell down. This isn't over. You don't know that either. I Whatever will you say. come back. When you do... Make sure you bring some shards. <sighs> Nobody listens to Sick me. of giving credit, and I need to change. All right. Wow, that guy lo sounds like an asshole. Talk. Hey, that's all traveler, these. is your throat dry? Are your feet aching? Whatever your problem, I have what you need. One good swig will cure all worries, and that's guaranteed. Um, we'll see about that. Yeah, I heard about uh, your fight with Brabak. I heard about your fight with Brabak. Ah, forget that guy. Every city has someone like him. You just have to ignore them. Let me know if I can do something for you. How is business? Now that everyone is paying credit? Roaring. <laughs> Not many people aren't happy to pay on credit. It's me that's holding the bill and hoping to get paid before I run out of supplies. Uh, speaking of which, do you know where I can get any food supplies? I'll pay real shards to get more food supplies in. I do have some survivability, I think. Most people try to earn a profit in your situation, huh? Try, yeah. Achieving is something different. I'd rather you get the supplies honestly, but... If you take them from people who have too much, who am I to question it? But if you steal from those with nothing, then I don't want anything from you. I like to keep things honest. Yeah, I get that completely. That's exactly my philosophy in most games. I steal from those who have too much. <laughs> Except I don't exactly always give to the poor, but that's because the games don't always offer you the option to actually give to the poor, which which is unfortunate, but yeah, that's the truth. Uh, okay, um, I guess I can't ask... Oh! Okay, I cannot ask him. Okay, yeah. Oh, I get, I get it. I need to talk to someone else, not him. Do you have any news to go with that drink? News? 
I presume you're talking about news from in here. I don't hear anything much from the outside now the city gates are sealed. Uh, the future of the Dome City is the only topic people are concerned about right now. That's pretty much all of the conversation. There's been peace in here for years, but right now, well, we're all set for things to boil over. I don't want to say it's the cleric's fault. It's always easy to blame the people in charge, isn't it? But who else do we blame? The berserkers, the outlaws, the separatists? Me? I find it best not to blame anyone. Hmm. Point taken. Here, my thanks to you. Oh, he, oh, he does give me. Okay, he does give me the key. Okay, never mind. So I did the right thing. Yeah, what do you expect me? I don't understand. Why have you given this to me? Yeah, I don't understand. I don't understand. Why have you given this to me? Any more? I cannot say. The mystery is key to this gift. Search out its meaning, and it will benefit you. Pass this test, and the secret will open to you. <laughs> uh, why are you making such a secret of it? Yeah, and I don't understand what you mean. Yeah, uh, I wanna, I wanna know. Why are you making such a secret of it? You will see when you find the meaning. Yeah, I will. <laughs> Oh um, my gosh. Okay, so I did the right thing right. by coming to him, and we got the key to the freaking really panel that you saw. <laughs> so now we can proceed. Okay, so I did the right thing. Okay, never mind. But now I lost this Brabag guy because I'm pretty sure we can have a quest with him. Ah, there he is, I think. Hey, come over here. Let's get a drink together. Uh, what are we celebrating? What are we celebrating? Victory over the Alps! Or do you have another reason to celebrate? Because any reason works for me! Victory over the Alps? Well, imminent victory! Got to be, hasn't it? Or don't you have any confidence in us? Don't say the wrong thing now. You got to believe if you want to succeed. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, yeah, I'll be honest with you. If you keep drinking, you're not going to beat anyone. What the? I was being hospitable there. Now you're opening your mouth and inviting someone to shut it. And I am so close to plugging it for you. But, because you're new, I'll give you a chance. One final chance. If you get the next round, we'll stay good friends. So, what'll it be? Are you gonna take it in the teeth, or feed it to the liver? <laughs> no thanks. I'll rather beat you up because you're kind of being arrogant. Show me what you've got. Ah, a fighter. Let's have you then, fighter. They're addicts, and that makes them dangerous. I'll meet you again later on. Oh! That is pretty suspicious. Well, that's one view of it. Okay, there you go. I beat him up. Yeah, mm, you're not that tough, really. <laughs> All talk, not much anything in you. What the fuck? You cheating bastard! Did you drug me? What the fuck did you do to me? I beat you, asshole. Yeah, yeah, keep pushing your luck. Someone will shut that big mouth permanently one day. Jesus, why is he so hostile? Why aren't you in a den with the other berserkers? Ah, fuck the berserkers. I don't have anything more in common with them. They would have exiled me to the valley sooner or later. So I beat them to the punch and left. Fuck them and their laws. You can have it much easier here. And if you want to earn something for nothing, try fighting one of the outlaws here in the domed city. Those assholes always come off worse. Just ask Riley. He knows it's time for him to take another beating. What the hell?
heck is wrong with you? Are you just beating them for no reason? Why are you doing this? Yeah, why do you want me to fight Riley? Why do you want me to fight Riley? It's about time someone pays him a visit. Now, you're the one to do it. That lying shit is telling people I killed a family out in the Badlands. Total fucking bullshit. I killed five families out in the Badlands. Parading around out there. Hardly a weapon between them. Like they wanted to die. Those dipshits got themselves killed. And now, Riley spread it all around the dome. He's even got some of the guards believing his yabber. But... But if someone else were to shut him up, I'd be in the clear, and those guards would be off my back. Take care of him, and I'll make it worth your while. How about you just go F off, hey? <laughs> I mean, first of all, I'm gonna probably just find Riley and get his point of view, but seriously, what the F is wrong with him? Where did you last see Riley? Well, the last time I saw him, there were two of him. I was too drunk to deal with the bastard. And the guards didn't waste a second to get me away from him. But my guess is he must be under the dome somewhere shitting himself. Okay, well... Hmm. Yeah, no, this guy... Ugh. God. He's messed up. Um, okay. Okay, well, let's find Riley because I forgot where he is in the Dome City. I mean, they always like to hang out over here in the fields and a little bit closer to that site. Yeah, apparently he's here. I just want to get his point of view of things, but no way in hell am I beating up, I think, for Brabeck. Hey, you. You're new to the city, aren't you? You're not a cleric I've seen before. You don't have any broken energy weapons, chainswords, or anything like that? That sort of thing is my business. So if you find any, bring them to me. I'll give you good prices for them. Did you flee here from the desert? Flee? No. But to live in Tavar, you need shards. And despite my talents, I wasn't one of the Duke's favorites, and that made making a profit hard. You think it's better here? Yes, for sure. For me, at least. And those berserkers are the worst for it. One of those assholes killed my friend for fun. Now that bastard is focused on me and nobody's helping me. Even though they know it'll be their turn next and keeping their head down won't save them. This berserker, is it Brawback? Yes, that is exactly the asshole I'm talking about. He murdered. Huh. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna go back to Brawback and just beat the shit out of him. About Brawback. Yeah, um... Oh, well, I did speak to him. But, um, hmm. You know what? I did save, so... I spoke to Brabak. I can imagine what he said. I'm sure he wants you to hurt me just for his pleasure. I can't tell you how much I need him to disappear from my life. I'll pay anyone who'll help me. Oh, no. I'm not saying this. Leave Brabak to me. No, I don't think that's a good idea. No, 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 actually, I don't want a cleric going anywhere near him. I'll end up in trouble with Alois, and that'll be almost as bad. I'm screwed either way. I don't think you are, but... Whatever, I'm, I'm still gonna provoke him. Ain't, it ain't my problem, because Brabeck had it coming, you know? He's a jerk, he's an asshole. Check the supplies. He's a criminal, that's why he was to... about to get exiled. He, uh, someone needs to teach him a lesson and punish him. You need to learn respect for others. You think that because you beat me once, that I'm afraid of you? You are so wrong. So piss off, or I'll give you your head on a plate. Give people some respect, and you won't need to fight. Let me tell you something right now. I'm gonna give your whore of a mother a reason to cry. Come here. I'll meet you again later on. <laughs> only saying that. Okay, that was uh, an interesting out of context. <laughs> that is pretty suspicious. Why did 
did you do that? Wow, she was ah, against it? Is the fight over? Ah, Kaya was against me beating a Brabak. Why? All right, all right. You've made your point. So leave me alone. Wow, I don't think I have that much combat. <laughs> I will take more than words to get me to leave. Haha. <laughs> you had better leave people alone from now on. I got it, I got it. From now on, keep your hands off the outlaws. And if I don't? Then you'd better find a bodyguard before I come back for you. All right, all right, fuck it, you get your wish. Smart decision. Uh, interesting that Kaya did not appreciate it whatsoever. Weird. Very weird. Huh. Oh well, <laughs> whatever. Um, hey Riley, uh, I beat up Brabak. I, th I think you can relax. About Brabak. You needn't worry about Brabak. He'll leave you alone. Leave me alone? He won't do that while he still draws breath. Oh, please tell me you didn't appeal to his conscience. He hasn't got one. Don't worry. I made things clear to him. He won't be back. Well, okay. Thank you. Thank you. That's what I wanted to hear. Wow. I might actually live through this year now. Thank you. Thank you. Here, this is for you. Let's trade. Okay. <laughs> Let's trade after uh, handing in a quest. Oh, he has a sulfur nugget. But nothing too special, so eh, whatever. Kaya, I'm disappointed in you. <laughs> All right, so let's go uh, open up that thing with a key before I forget again. But yeah, wow, I'm still sorry. I'm still shocked because wasn't Kaya all up for uh, justice and stuff like that? Why would she get pissed off for me beating up a jerk? I don't get it. I don't get it whatsoever. Okay. There you go. That's it. Yep, I was totally correct. It's that thing over there over there that opens. And it has a ladder. How nice. Hey okay, Kaya, I'll be going down this way. Oh, why am I using this? I can just jetpack my way through. Oh my gosh, the strobe lights are terrible. Ugh. And I can't see a damn thing except a lone rat. <laughs> and a bone. <laughs> a lone rat and a piece of bone. How nice. Ugh, you know what? Yeah, I cannot see a damn thing. <laughs> Oh. The claw will be your guide. Um, I, yeah, I found a claw. So, you must be the one who helped Rat. That speaks well of you. Come on through. Talk to Hector. He'll answer your questions. Not bad. Oh, well, Kai is like that bad for speaking to some weird people I don't know about. Okay, there's a, huh, there's a side entrance, I think. Or something. There's an enemy, apparently. <laughs> But man, the strobe lights are giving me a headache. Okay, I saw something big. Ow. Okay. Wish I would have been able to see more, but eh, whatever. I'm just curious about where this end of the tunnel leads before I go talk to people. Let's do this. Ah, okay, I'm an idiot. I, I wasn't able to initiate the jump, uh, the jump attack. Maybe because I'm not high enough? Oh boy. 
Huh. I wonder where, where this is located. Oh! It's located right over here, so that's how you can get here and meet the secret entrance, guys. That is interesting. Rat! <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh. Another one. I'm cleaning up the place for the best... <laughs> for, for the best feature of everyone. And now I feel a little bit lost. I think I need to go this way. Ah, there it is. There is the guy. Wait. Hold on. Thing down. Now was... you get clever. Hey, I was cleaning up the place. <laughs> wow, look at that. They got a base over here. And some people. But first of all, let's talk to the leader. Hector. I was sent to find you. By Darius, I'm guessing. And I assume you have a lot of questions about the claws. Who are you? My name is Hector. I am the leader of our network of the disinfected. Factions want it for themselves, don't they? All obedience and little reward. I was in the fort in Tavar when the Duke took it from Baxter. One new master to replace the old, and so I thought, why continue like that? So the Claws were born. Whatever faction, whatever land, we are everything and everywhere, and we reward all. Welcome to the Claws. Ah! So it's basically like a thieves guild, and Rat is part of it. Ooh, interesting. Makes sense, though. Rat has the personality... Uh, of someone who might be like part of a thieves guild even the way he talks and the way he acts totally fits what is this place this is our headquarters the center of our operations well that's a bit formal it's more a place that people can come and make contact we arrange deals we reward here we pledge to work with each other and to keep the word of the claws who are the claws we are an independent group dedicated to redistributing wealth to ourselves you mean you're thieves we take things but tell me of a faction that doesn't and they are only interested in their cause we are an organization of independent wealth acquirers who focus on our members we don't have ranks and we don't care which faction you are with we believe that the only thing that can help you survive and grow in this new world of ours is a Lexit. So, who is in this network? Oh, that you will discover as you travel across Magalan. We are everywhere, but we choose who we allow to join very carefully. None of us know about the entire network, and nobody apart from me knows the size of our organization. We are recognized by our mark, the claw. Show that, and another claw should assist you. But let's get to the real reason of your visit. Now that you know who we are, would you like to become part of our network? Yeah, sure, why not? But first of all, tell me more. What are the goals of the claws? The factions are at war. War for land, war for resources, war for war's sake. We have no interest in their politics. We simply want to ensure that whichever side wins, our members prosper. And this place has given us somewhere to stay while the Albs and the Clerics tried to blast each other out of existence. It will give us a place to store our riches until we have enough to found a new empire and the new world that will follow. And so the question is, Will you join us in this journey? Hmm. I don't think he uh, will appreciate this. Pretty much everyone will attack me is what I assume, but yeah, sure, I'll join you. I want to join you. Good. I had heard of you through our network and hoped you would choose to join us. Here, take this claw. It will demonstrate to others that you are now one of us. Now, if you wish, I will tell you how things run around here. Tell me how things work here. Very well. Our system is built in a way that allows you to continue working 
when nobody is here. Do you see the chests over there? When we are given an assignment, we will place it in one of those chests. Take a job, steal the desired object, and bring it back to one of our drop boxes. Where can I find your drop boxes? You can find them in all the cities, from the Hort to Goliath. You'll find them disguised as garbage cans. Place your target objects in there. And, if you need equipment to help you and can't steal it from anywhere, then you can buy it from Grizu. How do I get paid for assignments? As soon as one of our people has picked up the goods from the drop boxes, you will find your payment in your chest. We each have our own chest. You must leave the others untouched. So, go and get yourself a job from the chest and get going. Good luck. Yeah, so basically, uh, I can do these uh, chest quests and progress through the guild, or the faction, whatever you want to call it, um, and I believe they're not infinite the tasks you can do for the chests. And also, there might be a good source of, well, first of all, income for us, and um, I think experience as well. Take a job from the crate, then bring the requested item to the drop box. For the honor of the claws. The claw be my guide. We'll talk later. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. Well, thank you, I took some uh, Alexit already. And by the way, they are on a cliff. And if you're wondering, you can technically jet back over here, through here. Like, boop, like that. It's a bit tough. I tried that <laughs> uh, when I first uh, came here. When I first played the game, I tried that. And as you can see, everyone have their own chests. Like, there is Xander. So yes, Xander is part of the class. Ha ha ha, that idiot. <laughs> I, I hate that guy. Ooh, a golden chalice. Uh, Kata, we haven't met that person yet. Uh, Yasma, I think it's this woman. Yeah, that's her. Ooh. Oh, I picked up a rare weapon, apparently. What did I pick up? It's an energy weapon. Ah, it's a laser weapon. And... Can you upgrade it? Interesting, interesting. Uh, yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a laser weapon. I don't think it might be, but I don't think that it's better than this, this one over here. I'll be honest. Yeah, I think it's about the same. Except I'm able to uh, install one of the shards or whatever. But yeah, mm. found that. Uh, a job trunk, small mana potion, um, ooh, wine, hammer, wine, rats' chest, a key. ah, yeah, I need a key, Darius's chest, ooh, dual skill amulet, I think I might have that already. Then we have, uh, Grisus' chest, and there's a locker with some Alexit. So yeah, let's talk to first this lady. Hello, my name is Yasma. But before you say a word, know this. I don't want to know who you are. I don't want to know what your name is. I am not interested in where you're from or what you're doing here. If you can remember that, then we'll get along just fine. Why don't you want to know about me? Who you say you are means nothing to me. I have met so many people, so many claws who have disappeared and never shown up again. I do not want to repeat that experience. You might not want to know anything about me, but I want to know who you are. There is little to say. I have lived my life on my own. One day I was robbed, seriously wounded and left to die. An outlaw by the name of Rat found me and helped me get back on my feet. He told me he knew of a place where I could be safe, where I could learn the skills of a thief. In return, I would have to teach those abilities to others. That is how I came to be here. That is why I stayed. That is interesting, except I don't like the screen angle. Hopefully this works better. Will you teach those skills to me? As Darius allowed you in, I assume you're someone who could be worthy. So please, what would you like to know? 
Teach me something. Oh All right. <laughs> I don't. I don't like the the fact that for some damn reason, the 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 auto brightness adjustment is so crappy. But she's basically a craft trainer. <laughs> That's about it. She teaches you crafts. Then there's this guy. Looking to buy something? Ooh, you buy or sell. Buy or sell. I sell, you buy. Though I do buy too, sometimes. Altogether, I'm into buying and selling things. So if you have anything you need to offload before the original owner finds out, then you can bring those items here to me. I have some goods to sell. Ah, a few more items been liberated, have they? Show me what you have. I don't have anything that's liberated, but wow, look at that baby. A modified grenade launcher and oh my gosh, I, I don't know how I'll get so much Alexit, but damn. <laughs> Ooh, a black leather cowl. Now that looks really nice. Okay, uh, he has basically a lot of the same basic stuff I already have. Ooh, amulet of camouflage. Use this to create an amulet that delays enemy attacks. Oh, okay. Okay, I got it, but no thanks. No thanks. Okay, I think I'm pretty much done with this guy. Yeah, he has nothing else for me. Uh, and I guess the last one to talk to is this guy. Darius. <laughs> I found the secret entrance. So I saw. Where did you get the key? Um, I think this might be delayed. Uh, the barkeep? From Vito, the barkeeper from the Dome City. So, you stole the key? Huh, not bad. Um, I did not. For he the gave claws. it. He gave it to me. Jeez. Oh well, whatever. Okay, let's sleep so that I'll recover my health and let's go open up that uh, job trunk and see what's the first task. Although, I think I might remember what it was from my previous. Uh, playthrough. Cause mission supply crates from Golid. Aha, yeah, I remember this one. Well, at least some parts of it. Okay, let's see. Where's the little paper thingy? There you go. Details of a mission for the Claws, Oren. Mission! The domed city is short of most supplies. The berserker Oren, or Oren, manages the drinking establishment in Goliet. Yeah, we do know him. We have learned that he has a hidden supply room. We should relieve him of a few supply crates. This will go unnoticed by the powers that be. Uh, he can hardly report that he has been concealed his this horde. Uh, that sounded a, a little bit fragmented, but okay. Steal Oren's key to the supply room and take it at, and take at least four supply crates. Reward 300 shards. Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> Notes: Oren always carries the key on him. A good pickpocket pick shouldn't have any trouble taking it from him. Proceed with care. We believe the hatch to uh, his supply room is further secured by some sort of trap. A good pair of eyes will be uh, needed to spot it. Yeah, mm, that might be problematic because I'm not that great at uh, sneaking. Although I could probably invest to, 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 get, to get a better pickpocketing. Oh, not really. Um, hmm. Actually, I might be able to. Hold on. Hold on. I think, hmm. I'm kind of short of some dexterity points. Eh, whatever. Whatever. We're we're gonna we can try at least, right? Okay, so let's see. Goalie it, right? Oh wait, no. I forgot the domed city as well. Because we have some jobs to do here. And I'm too lazy, so I'm gonna teleport into into the outside of the dome city. But yes, there's some tasks we can do. Because we haven't talked to every single person, so yeah. Let's try that. Oh, also, uh, does you do you have anything? Keep your pockets closed and your eyes open. Unless you want to end up shardless and dead in the hands of those damn outlaws. Okay. <laughs> Nothing, I guess. Uh... Alrighty, let's go there. I believe that's where we find some important people. Somewhere over here. Oh! Look, I think this is an important person. Hey, you! Let me guess. I'm not allowed into the upper quarter? What? 
No, everyone's allowed to move about freely here. I just have a question for you. You got here recently, right? I just want to know what things are like outside the dome. What's going on out there? Are the Alps attacking? Oh, they kind of are. <laughs> there is war going on. You must have heard about it. <laughs> well, there are raids so far. There are raids, but there have been no major assaults recently. I'm sure that's just the calm before the storm. I just hope the dome holds. There's a lot of people depending on this dome of mine. So they pass us by like a river around a rock. Kalan gave us the knowledge, and now look what we've achieved. A safe harbor for all people. The clerics and Ignodons say we've strayed. I say we've found the true path. You built the dome? I designed the plans for it, then we built it together. My name is Eric, by the way. Chief engineer here in the dome. I'm in charge of all the generators and technicians who oversee them. Why don't we have a dome like this in the Hort? The dome requires immense amounts of energy, and the fluctuations in it have to be constantly balanced. The technology is complex. That means there's no way to cover the Hort with a shield like this. Besides, the cliffs around Hort give it a natural protection. Can this dome survive an Albatac? Of course. Why do you think we built it? As long as we can maintain a constant energy flow, then they can't get in. Unfortunately, achieving that isn't so easy. Some of the energy regulators are starting to malfunction again. Huh. Yeah, I could repair them. I can repair the energy regulators for you. Thanks for the offer, but that's not necessary. I've already repaired the components. They just haven't all been installed yet. Yeah, I do have a forged idea, I guess. I forgot whose idea it was. But first of all... About the broken energy regulators. What will happen if they aren't repaired? If just one regulator fails, it could mean an emergency shutdown for the dome. Otherwise, the discharge it would create could kill a whole lot of the people the shield is supposed to be protecting. But whether it's a discharge or an emergency shutdown, both scenarios would see us defenseless. How many energy regulators are broken? Well, all of them. I've sorted replacements where I can. But Lutz hasn't received his yet. I will help you with the energy regulators. I wanted to do it myself, but do you really think you could handle it? But I wouldn't have expected anything else from a cleric. I have the energy regulator here. Please, take it to Lutz and help him to install it. Come back to me when you're done. I have no idea where Lutz is, but first of all, give me a moment because... Wait, before you go... And I... Okay, fine, I saved so I'll be able to find him. Uh, whose ID do I have? Oh, Cooper. Counterfeit ID that can be used by the Dome City of Abessa. Cooper, Cooper, Cooper. Maybe I can find Cooper. Hold on. <laughs> Let me go He's seek this Cooper guy. Oh, I found Paige. I think I have her quest still. I think you can just leave it like that. Um, but where do I find the guy? It's just... Oh! A bloody burger recipe. Well, that's a new one. Um... I found him. I didn't do anything. What do you want with me this time? Absolutely nothing. Uh, don't tell me nothing. I don't believe that. Not for a second. You clerics act like this city belongs to you. Screw you. Screw your faction. Screw all the factions. Take me to your damn suggestors or leave me alone. Um, why? Uh, well, Hunter did send me. I can at least help you to, ki to get you out, I guess. Maybe. What is it that you're planning? What's that got to do with you? You expect me to trust you just like that? Hmm, well, Hunter sent me. Hunter sent me. Why didn't he come himself? He was afraid he wouldn't be let out of the city again if he was caught. You mean he was afraid the same thing would happen to him that happened to me? Fuck it. At least the suggestors haven't found me yet. Did Hunter give you something for me? Yeah, he did. He did. Okay, well, I'm gonna give him the idea because at least he'll be able to get out, but... At least I'm in the dome, you know, honestly. <laughs> Yes, I have something for you. Thanks. I was starting to think that I would never leave this stinking cleric-infested dome. 
I don't know if Hunter promised you a reward, but here's something for me in any case. You've helped a good cause. Trust me. I'm not so sure about that, but... Okay, let's hope that this isn't gonna end up badly for everyone. Every one of us. Okay, well, uh, let me, let me... Am I crazy? Or is our generator power fluctuating? Yeah, no, your generator is totally fluctuating. Now, there's another person I know I should be finding. Good to see you! The dome is a gift from Kalan. Yeah, he says the same thing, okay. There, there's supposed to be another person somewhere. Ah! Somewhere here. There's way too many people, Jesus! <laughs> The B series was no, never very her. reliable. You know that. Uh, hopefully, that person I'm looking for is somewhere around here because this place is ginormous. Try and steal something, and you'll regret it. Yeah, I know, I know, but I'm looking for a very special person. Hmm. I guess not here. Did you lose something? Yeah, I lost the person I'm trying Hi. to find. Who's there? Although I feel like there should be like a doorway somewhere somewhere near here. Maybe. Okay, I think I'm way Ooh! Well I'm finding fragmentation grenades and rockets. <laughs> That's actually really useful. But no, this is not where I want to be. I guess this other person is somewhere... Somewhere here. Maybe. Well, there's this guy, but... Not quite the person I was looking for, but oh well. Can't be too picky. <laughs> yes. Is there something urgent? I have a lot to do, as you can imagine. This city does not run itself. So, please excuse me if I am short with you. This city is made up of a whole mass of confusion. Everyone looking for a new start. No one able to forget their past. They need a leader to hold things together. Huh. Leadership and a strong faith. Well, I guess. Leadership and a strong faith. Correct. That is what distinguishes a true cleric. That is why I'm glad both of us are on the same page. Everyone here wants something. Whatever you're searching for, it will only add to the list of demands we already face. And providing for the people we already have is a logistical challenge. That means to accommodate everyone, we're on strict rations, and those rations have to be earned. I wouldn't have expected the clerics to care so much for others. You're doing good work here. Some of our brothers turned away from our oath. They believe the Hort and Ignodon must come before anything else. But what is a cause without conviction? How long have you been in charge of the Dome City? I've been in office for eight years now, and it hasn't been easy. Maintaining a neutral position to the factions while fighting the Albs. By Kalan, there really are more pleasant posts they could have appointed me to. Yeah, but uh, that's a good question. What if someone wanted to replace you? Some have tried, yet I am still here. This city was created by the Great Council of Magalan. They made the clerics custodians of this place and their legacy. The Great Council may be long gone, but what they stood for, a unity of purpose, a future for all of Magalan together, that is something we still believe in here. So, it is our job to remain neutral. It is our job to serve all, no matter their background, however hard our residents make it for us. How are things here in the Dome City? Tense. The battles out there are always reflected in here. Tensions run high if the outlaws attack the clerics, or the clerics attack the berserkers. And there's always the fear of an Alb invasion. Those tensions drive greed, anger, and fear. There is war out there, and here your shards will be stolen from your hand if you aren't careful. It's like the world has gone crazy. Hmm. Why have things become so bad? That's a whole host of reasons. I may be able to help you if I tell you how things are. The Berserkers have lived more and more reclusively ever since the Pilgrim went into his retreat. The Outlaws are more organized now the Duke has taken power, and the Alb Separatists seek shelter with us to escape the powers in Zakor. All told, very dark signs that we'd face another global catastrophe. And here we are, in the middle. 
Yeah, I don't envy you your your job. <laughs> I really don't. Is there something I can help you with? We all need help at times. You must have noticed that the mood is very heated here. One more issue, one wobble, and everything we've held together here will fall to pieces. One of my people has reported that the outlaws are expecting a weapons delivery. The last thing that this city needs is more weapons. And who knows who the outlaws will sell them to. I want you to intercept this delivery and bring it to me. Hey, I think this is related to Paige, isn't it? <laughs> okay, yeah, I agree with you. I mean, in some re I mean, in some regards people need weapons, but in others I'm quite it's yeah, it's very questionable to whom the weapons go to. What if they go for usurping and destroying the Dome City and everything that the Council of Magellan stands for? Yeah, I don't want that to happen. Are you having a lot of trouble here in the city? Keeping the factions together is always an issue. The outlaws are always up to something, but things have gotten worse, and to cap it all, we've had a sharp rise in thefts. I believe an organized group has started operating here. Not the usual outlaws. This group seems to be outside the factions. From the little I've heard, they're more like a secret society than your regular set of theft mongers. I've offered a large bounty for any information that leads to their capture, and capture would be best. I want to find out who their connections are, if you can find out more about this secret society, I can make you rich. Um, about, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna tell you about the claws. <laughs> Sorry, Aloy, but that's one thing I'm not willing to share with you. About the outlaws' weapons delivery. Ooh, yeah, I can betray Paige, but I would ask this question though. You've been using informers to try and catch them? Of course. Information is key to keeping the peace. But there are always things you miss. And missing things leads to nasty surprises. And I'd rather be the one dealing those out than receiving them. Particularly when it comes to outlaws. Are you going to show me that you are the exception? Hmm. Not yet. Not yet. Listen, the council is gone. Why care about what they said? You don't think that was a better time? Laws for prisoner exchange, that assured borders, set rules for trade? Even if you don't care about the blood spilled since the council's rule was broken, the cleric swore to a code, and that includes keeping our oaths. And an oath was sworn to the council by my forefathers. That makes it my duty to see that oath is kept. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so there's a lot of things to unpack. Uh, okay, I've... I feel like I'm gonna have to find the lady, maybe... Yeah, it, it, the one I'm trying to find is a woman. I feel like I'm gonna have to find her in the next episode, but first, I wanna find the guy for whom I'm supposed to deliver the shiny ma the thingy majigi from Eric. Yeah, for lots. Oh, he's all the way there. Okay, lots, I'm getting over here. You're about to get your delivery of whatever. Whee! Ow. Okay, lots should be all the way up here. Those ruins are still full of useful things. If you look in the right place. There he is. Now, I want to just make sure I deliver the thing he needs as quickly as possible, just in case. I don't remember if this is a timed mission, so... Keep your hands off my machines. I don't care if you are a fellow cleric, unless... How are you when it comes to engineering? Do you have any experience? I'm trying to work out whether to use a single phase or triple phase generator for the energy supply system. I think I'm good. <laughs> a three phase. I assume you want to free up a few surge capacitors in the system. If that's the case, a three phase generator would provide you with constant power. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Ha, huh, nice to meet someone who understands this kind of thing. Thanks for the help. You're welcome, you're welcome. Well, Eric sent me. Eric sent me. Oh, thank Kalan. Do you have the energy regulator? Yes. Here. Perfect. That looks great. Thanks. Thanks for getting that. I'll install it immediately. You better get back to Eric. You can tell him I'm putting it in right now. Also, yeah, let me finish speaking with you. 
I heard you are having trouble establishing communications with the Horde in Ignodon. That is just... Wait. How do you know that? That's confidential. I'll be honest with you. One of the outlaws told me. The outlaws? The last thing we need is for them to know about our problems. Do you think it's just one outlaw that knows, or do they all know? I have no idea. That is a worry, a real worry. Well, we can't waste any more time. We need to fix that comms relay station before anyone tries to take advantage of our problems. Since you're in the know, can you help me? Yeah, sure. Um, you can count on me. <laughs> you can count on me. Good, thank you. If you don't help us, we could lose everything we have here. And if things fall apart out there, you can be certain that it will get bloody for everyone. What's so important about fixing your communications right now? We're awaiting the delivery of some combat mechs. But they haven't arrived, and we've no way to check why without communications being re-established. That's why we've got to get the link back up now, so we can find out what's going on. Ah, that makes sense. What do you need combat mechs for? I don't know. I guess they're worried about security. And supplies. We need firepower to get enough food and tech spares into the dome to keep things going. And that's before the Alps. Zaycor might have left us alone recently, but who knows how long that'll last. But it's not just about mechs. It's about food and news and everything else. We need a link with the Hort to keep this place going. We need to get this fixed as soon as possible. And please, please, keep this problem confidential. Otherwise, we are very likely to face even greater challenges. Here are the coordinates of the relay station that's gone down. It's over to the northeast of the city. Head that way and keep looking out for an antenna on the horizon. But I have no idea what the issue is there. You might be able to fix it at the bottom, but there's a chance you might have to climb the antenna mast. There will be a device somewhere on site that you can use to recalibrate the antenna. I hope that'll be enough to fix the problem. Okay, sure. Uh, I'll help you. Is that it? Maintenance is always better than repair. Okay, yeah, I guess that's it. Anyway, guys, I'm way past our time, so I'm gonna have to end the episode here. Uh, thank you for watching, and let me know what you think about, you know, generally the game, the pacing, blah, 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 all the usual stuff. Uh, and anyway, um, I'll see you later. Bye-bye!